Hello, welcome to this episode of Auto Tutorials by Lemonstration Studios. My name is Lydia, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can change the basis of your shape key permanently in Blender. Let's get started. I'm going to be using Maya for this video, and as you can see, by selecting the mesh, she selected, you can see that she has this eyelid and eyelid left and right, and these shape keys are used for a blink. So, and I have this new face I added, which is new face. <laughs> so by dialing this up, see a face changed from the initial face from this to this. Now, let's say I want to edit the eyelid and you see that the new face is active and I want to edit the eyelid left and I click on this pin. See, it reverts back to the basis. So this video, I'm going to show you how you can change permanently. So to do that, let me remove this pin, go back to the basis, go to edit, edit mode. That is by coming back down here, object mode, change to edit mode. Select the faces, that's A, to select all the faces. Then go to Vertex, um, Blend from Shape. So the first thing you do, you have to select the shape key you want to change. Then go to Vertex, Blend from Shape. By selecting it, you come down here to the um, dialog window. Then change this from basis to new face. So you want to change the basis to the new face. You can check Add. So by going back to object mode, you see that it is really crazy. And this is because the new face is added twice, from the basis and then from the new face. So just, we don't need this anymore. You can dial it down or delete it. So now if I go to eyelid left or eyelid right, or I want to do any other thing, or I create a new shape. For instance, if I click on new, this new shape will be connected, will be attached to the new one. So now the new basis is now <laughs> the new face. So now if I go to, and eyelid left, see that the new face is now what is active. So it's as simple as that. So that's the end of this video. Don't forget to like the video if you like it. Subscribe to our channel if you've not done so. And until next time, stay true to your creativity. Bye bye.